Hey everyone, this is uh, Tom from Blue Root here. Today I'm going to show you Soho Sheet View, what it's used for, and how it can be really a powerful tool uh, for your CRM. So what I'm going to show you today is how to use Zoho Sheet View to change the lead source of some of these clients that I have here. So what I want to do is change the lead source of all clients who have the lead source of advertisement to the lead source instead of web research. And that's what I'm going to do. So the first thing to do would be to filter on everyone who is a lead source from advertisement. And how I would do that is through the view up here. So that's what I'm going to do. And so to create a new view, I'm going to go to the bottom and hit create view. And then I can just name it uh, anything that's relevant to what I'm showing here. So this will be advertisement clients. And then you specify the criteria. So I want my lead source is, and then I can choose what it is here. So I'll, I do want to change it to web research, but I'm going to have advertisement for now. And then you choose basically the fields that you want to show up in your Zoho sheet view. So first name, last name is good. I don't care as much about phone, so I'll delete that, that. But I do care about lead source. So I'm going to add that. And then I'm going to share it with only me for now. I'm going to hit save. So this is everyone who is an advertisement client. So someone with the lead source of advertisement. So you can see I only have three here. So now that you have this view, you can now access Zoho Sheet View by just looking at these three clients. So to do that, you hit the dot, 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 and you go down to this here, Zoho Sheet View. I'm going to click it. It comes with a little warning. Everything's fine. And I can hit continue. So what happens here is it basically takes what I showed on that other screen. Um, but instead of the view that I saw before, it shows up almost like a, an Excel sheet. So it's powerful, first of all, because you can visualize it and you can start doing some data manipulation quickly. The other way is you can really update records very quickly. So that's what I'm going to do now. So in advertisement, I'm going to instead do web research. And then I'm going to paste it here. So I feel good about that. So once I'm good with the changes, I'm just going to hit save. And the important thing here is to make sure it completely saves. You see how it's saving? You have to wait till this shows up, which is the spreadsheet saved successfully. Once that's shown, you can exit this view. And now what it'll see is, so Tom Hall is here. So I'm going to refresh. And you can see what's going to happen is there's going to be no records because now no one has a lead source of advertisement anymore. Instead, if I type in Tom Hall here, and I find the client, Tom Hall, you can see that this lead source is now web research. So everything that I did in the sheet view is reflected in the Zoho CRM. And that's it. The last thing that I'll say just as a best practice, it's so now that I'm done this, I'm just gonna delete this view now because I don't need it anymore. So I'm gonna go back into here, select the view that I want, hit edit, and then hit delete. And hit delete, and now it's done. So that was a quick tutorial of Zoho Sheet View. I hope you found it useful. Bye for now.